Oh god, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> Let's just have a look at our options here and have a little think. Maybe I should intro the episode first before I do that. Uh, oh my god, my my desire to play this game is uh, entirely overriding all of the other things that I should be paying attention to or thinking about at the moment. Uh, it's a bit of a problem, to be honest. Welcome back to Rift Wizard 2. Uh, this this uh, we're, we're Realm 11 out of the potential 20. Uh, that's not that far in, honestly. Uh, it's been really slow going, and I would like to increase the pace, <laughs> at least somewhat. Uh, but I am prohibited by, you know, my own brain's processing speed, which is, uh, it's not that good. I, I don't get nearly as many cycles as, uh, as I would like, but hey, you know, yeah, that's, uh, that's just kind of what I have to deal with, so. Anyway, let's, let's try to actually make some goddamn progress here. So we're, we're doing blood magic stuff. Uh, it's going pretty well, all things considered, but we could definitely use some more something something some some sort of end goal that we're working towards here i don't know i have a lot of resources 11 sp is a pretty good amount so i should probably be spending that on something but i'm still not sure what that thing is gonna be let's just what what a what a what a what, a, what kind of rewards we got hanging around in here we've got discs for various things these increase radius so yeah i think it i i think i'm i'm pretty sure at this point trinkets are just you can get as many of them as you like, so they, they're per they're not- they're small additions on their own generally, but they can stack as many times as you want. Uh, as far as these discs go, the only one that I might want would be the Sorceress disc. I think that only applies to Dream Pulse though, so that doesn't- it's not astonishingly- Oh, it would technically apply to Bone Spear, but I think that only uh, works for the Toxic Spear upgrade, so... Uh, which I don't have yet, and may never have, so... Uh. There's pets over here, but as we've discussed uh, previously... Uh, well, I mean, if I can find it in things... Uh, I can't really see much about said pets. Pets, not pests. I mean, there might be that too, I don't know. Troll-Blooded Void Rift, Death Chill, Immortal Death Chill Chimera, Fae Greater Vampire. I mean, they look fine, but I don't know that any of them necessarily are going to synergize, especially with what we're doing here. And then the last thing is a bunch of Ice Trinkets, which we have no Ice Spells. So, nothing particularly, nothing particularly attractive. I guess that's true. Life Drain can get a Radius with the Life Funnel upgrade. Life Funnel does seem pretty good, I guess. I might actually want to get that. So maybe I'd want the enchanting disc? Can I like get a radius? Yeah, apparently. What upgrade is that on? Radiant Heat. Half damage to units. To units around the target, not to enemy units, just all units. Seems like maybe I don't necessarily want that. Okay, I think the main question about which realm I'm going into here is going to be how greedy I feel, more than anything. Because, like, this realm looks doable. I don't know how good it's necessarily going to be for me, but it doesn't seem, like, super hard, I guess. Even though, you know, the reward is, like, not especially spicy looking. So yeah, then it becomes more a question of, do I want to re-roll to try and get something that's actually gonna be, like, really good for me? I guess. Like, we're pretty light on strong, like, bonus pieces here. Yeah, fuck it, whatever. Okay, we got more hearts. Okay, that's always a good option. Uh, trinket boxes, some weird stuff here. Let's have a look at them. Monkey Skull Amulet. Sorcery spells and skills gain three duration. That doesn't apply to my sorceries, I don't think. Conjuration spells and skills gain one radius. Also doesn't apply. Enchantment sp spells and skills gain six minion damage. What the fuck? <laughs> what is this? 
Are there even any enchantments that like sometimes are like a thing? Oh. Stampede form? I don't see, think I've seen this. Become an elephant? And also summon 10 elephants around you. What the fuck? That seems pretty funny. Okay, so there are options for that. And then it was like... Sorcery spells and skills gain duration. I guess that works with like Ice Ball or something. Conjuration gains a radius. What would that even apply to? Ghost Ball? Ugh. Okay, yeah, so it's... It's like corner case stuff, like it seems pretty powerful if you can take advantage of it, but I don't think anything that I'm doing or anything that I want to be doing is necessarily going to work with this thing. What else do we have here? Sorcerer's Tome adds charges for sorceries, I guess. I mean, it gives Drain Pulse one, which is kind of nice, but other than that, it's not super notable. Uh, fire damage goes up, and then this one is, for every 100 dark damage dealt to enemies, summon a witch. Well, I guess with Life Drain, we are doing a fair amount of dark damage. Drain Pulse also does dark damage. I mean, it's probably okay, at least. And what's over here? Well, just more goddamn pets. Well, what do I think about this? Spore Beasts aren't a big deal. Rolling Spike Balls are fine, I think. Probably. Troll-blooded steel spider. Well... It seems like it would be kind of hard to kill, I guess, but... It, it doesn't look like there's too many of them. Immortal Hellhound. Ugh. I wonder if some melee attackers. I'm not seeing anything... insurmountable about this. Even with the current setup, I don't think I need to spend any SP in order to be able to manage this. Which is good. Because, you know, hmm. I feel like this this is just pretty manageable. We just, like, drop a... Yeah, we just drop the Flesh Fiend and then start draining stuff. And yeah, you know, it's like normal... Normal, normal stuff here. I think, I think it should be okay. Yeah, alright, let's just do it. All right, I have my other friends here as well. I forgot about them. Sure, all right. We'll get Flesh Fiend over there. Drain these spawners. Yeah, more drains. Okay. Flesh Fiend's doing its thing. All right, so the spawners will be taken care of. I got enough to throw up another Flesh Fiend, I suppose. Um, Just get him in there. So the spike balls, I guess, are kind of hard to kill, right? Because they have the fizz resist. I mean, they do die to this stuff eventually. Might as well drain that too, why not? Okay, well, it looks like that one, yeah. That, that hellhound's been killed one time here. Uh, the spider's trying to, like, bite me. Go away. Oh, he did go away. Neat. Um, okay. So the only other spawner is over here, so I guess I'll start heading in that direction? I don't know. Oh, this spike ball's not as dead as I would like it to be. Maybe I'll just, like, wait a turn. Okay, still not dead. Whatever. It'll... we'll get there. Train this thing. Okay, get more stuff, more Flesh Fiends, please. Uh... I guess, yeah, training these stupid spiders is probably a good idea. And maybe also immolating them just to remove that, that point regeneration? I don't know. 90? Yeah, they should still die from it eventually. Alright, let's just get all of my Flesh Fiends into play. I think that's probably fine. I think I just start, I don't know, throwing bone spears around. Let me get this stupid spider out of my way, please. 
drain that. Drain that. Shoot spears this way until everything is gone. Uh, yeah. This is fine. This is fine. I mean, if anything, we're probably just good from here, right? Like, whatever. I guess I'll go ahead and drain these other spike balls. Uh, right. There's only... The Aether Spinous Water is the only thing that's really a problem here. I honestly could probably just... Uh... Just wait the rest of it out. I don't think we're gonna lose from here. Although it'll probably go faster if I actually contribute, I guess. Damn ether spiders. They they do have fizz resist, don't they? Yeah, they have a lot of it actually. Well, whatever. Drain these things away. Let's just throw drains around. I'm not in danger of dying or anything, but it'll make things die faster, I guess. Hey, this thing's still alive, what the hell? Get the emulate on that. Uh, what's even... Oh, it's just this guy, right? Okay. Whatever. I'm sure you guys have got this. Hooray. Okay, anything cool coming up? Uh, we've got conjure trinkets. I guess max charges is pretty good for conjuration, right? Maybe I'm getting Lumbria Genesis at some point, and then getting the big wormy boys. Got sigils. Displacer brood mothers, which then make more displacer beasts. Hmm. Greater vampires, void slimes. Eh. These staffs. I mean, the blade staff's been very effective with life drain so far. I don't know that we're going to want to be relying on life train for less, like a long time, you know? So we might want to look to replace it at some point here, but... The damage result with holy spells, cast emulate on random enemy. Well, I don't think that's doing anything for me. Oh, this is Blaze Limb again. Yeah, that's also not really... With enchantment spells. Well, I mean, it's not... I mean, it is... Pretty good. Well, it is good with the life drain, except that if I lose the blade stuff, life drain's damage is going to go down a lot. So, eh. Twilight Oculus. Yeah, this is like a dark holy damage remover, whatever. I think I kind of like trying to stack more conjuration charges. It just seems like it would be good. How awful does this look to deal with? There's a lich. I mean, that's... Probably similarly dealable with, in a way, to um, the ice liches that we were going up against. I mean, there's more of them around, but it doesn't have death touch. That's nice. Oh, there's a blood magus. Interesting. So this bloodhounds, mass blood rage. Oh, this thing has it uses its own life train and bone spear. Interesting. Well, I mean, Flesh Fiends kind of beat this thing down really effectively, so I don't know. I don't know that I'm that scared of it. Range all allied units by seven. Yeah, that mass blood rage thing, though, is, is a bit spooky. Spawns hands, which flick things around, which is probably a bit awkward with the Flesh Fiends, because they are kind of like a wall for me, so if they get, like, displaced, I might end up in a, a rather tricky situation. Fire Spirit Spawners, those are not that big of a deal, probably. And Burning Old Witch. They have this, like, yeah, fire radius thing. It's presumably the ghosts that they make do as well. Ugh. That sounds pretty unpleasant to deal with. 
Ghosts are, ghosts are an issue for me. I don't think I have almost any way to deal with them, other than the Immolate, which is very inefficient at dealing with them, because it's single target and they're like low hit point targets. Generally immune to dark damage and physical damage and poison damage, so it doesn't leave me with a lot of options. I could always just pick up, you know, Fireball or something like that to help me clear them. I can wait until I actually have to deal with the ghosts. I mean, they, they do make temporary ghosts, so they, they also go away. You don't have to fight them. And the main problem is if I get flicked somewhere awkward, I could be in a lot of trouble. But other than that, I'm not that concerned about this map. I, it feels doable. Damage 6 range. I guess, yeah, these liches are a bit... They do kind of suck, because I'm going to have to figure out some way to actually get around them. Bone Spear's got pretty long range now, but it's not going to be, like, long enough to comfortably deal with that. I got a couple Oculuses that, that I can use if I need to, but... One, two, three, four liches, and they're not very clustered. I mean, it could be a situation of just getting, like, teleport or something. You only got one, huh? Okay, well, let's grab this Witch Whistle, I guess, while I'm here. Is that what I'm doing? If I took the Sorcery Tome now, it means my teleport would have an extra charge. That is actually fairly considerable. What is my damage? I, well, most of my damage is coming from the fleshy masses. They're just, like, punching stuff really hard. So, theoretically, if I'd had this Witch Whistle on this map, I only would have spawned five of these witches with it. Yeah, maybe I don't care, actually. <laughs> maybe, yeah, maybe, okay, maybe I'm picking the Sorcerer's Tome up and I'm probably looking to... Uh, well, I should probably, if I'm gonna do that, I would want to... Oh, uh, no, actually, it's fine. I could wait to get teleport, I guess. Okay. Yeah, all right. I think that's fine. I was thinking about I want to start somewhere down here so I can, like, take care of these spawners, but also deal with this Blood Magus so he's not constantly buffing the whole map's damage for the entire thing. Somewhere around here should be okay. Slush range, range? Seven. This should be fine, then. Okay, so how bad are these ghosts for me, practically speaking? They only have 50% dark resist, actually. So Life Drain kills them if I really need to get rid of them, but I don't even know if that's going to be a huge concern. Okay. Don't know what just happened. Uh, maybe when I get the emulate going on this lich. Has this lich dropped a soul jar? Might have gotten destroyed already. All right, more life train, please. And these ones all have 50% life drain resist, which is a bit awkward, but... Ow. Eight dark damage, wow. Yeah, the, the blood rage is, is definitely causing some... some troubles for me here. Ugh. I don't even know if Drain Pulse is gonna help me that much here. Uh, it should still do a pretty good chunk, as the... I take half the dark and all the poison. It'll kill the ghosts. I think I'm drain pulsing. Yeah, that seems like it was probably a good call. Okay, this lich is gonna die to the immolation. This blood mage. I guess maybe I should also just immolate him because he's being very persistent. And maybe we get some more flesh dudes to soak for us. Flesh dudes, more drain, more drain. Is this manageable? Maybe, I don't know. 
Spore Beast is gonna bite it pretty soon here. Uh, I should, I guess, drain these things while they're around. Try to get more life going. Eh, yeah, maybe drain this guy too while I'm at it, what the hell. Okay, I think I can probably afford to... Flesh Fiend here? Oh, I guess these stupid hands are actually kind of a problem though, huh? Yeah, the hands are not great for, um... <laughs> you can't just throw a fleshy fiend in front of them and say, like, Oh, soak this forever, because they'll, like, teleport them away. What the flick? Okay, maybe I'm gonna start throwing spear in here or something. Okay, so this Lich's phylactery is all the fucking way over there. What a dick. I feel like I need to try and rely on fleshy mass to like kind of carry me. I thought... Okay, I have only cast two of them. Yeah, ooh. Ooh, it's a bit not good. Yeah, the problem is I don't have... There, there aren't a lot of good life drain targets around now. Whatever, I guess I'll... Ooh. Yeah, and when I emulate these fire spirits get larger, actually, which is not good for me. Um, okay, try to get some life back here. Okay, maybe I am picking up teleport now. So if I come over here, I can like drain this stuff away. And then, once this lich is low enough, I'll just like spear this jar, and it'll at least take care of him. And then I'll have one more life train. I can try to work my way up towards this or something. I don't know, man. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, hang on. This still has some life. I guess maybe I'll just drain this before I leave. I don't know. More drain. Okay, this is fine. Let's let's go. Oh, teleport. Oh, I thought I had further range than that. That's interesting. Um Okay. Maybe I'm going to need to get a little closer then. Okay. This lich is is now yeah. At the point where I need to deal with it. That hand is in kind of an awkward spot actually. Okay, this should do. You go away. Okay, Lich is dead. These purple hands are very likely to cause problems for me. Oh, uh, okay, he teleported me in a good direction. <laughs> Lucky me. Alright, I'll just get this life drain on this uh, spawner here. And there's another hand, but that's okay. We can just drain him too. Uh, more flesh fiends. Get in there. Okay, this one's going to despawn. Burning old witch. Whatever. Just fire bone spears, I guess. Can I hit both of these? No? Okay. Okay, so this Lich's thing is over there. That kind of sucks. Like, it's just not very good for me. Now. Oh boy. Um, okay. Well, I still have this teleport, so maybe it's time to do that. I could always, like, come over here and then just, like, drain pulse or something. Yeah. I think I'm peacing out. Okay, this is alright. Okay, it should probably die there. Get this. 
Oh man, hey, a ghost, if you could uh, actually kill that uh, soul jar, that would be really nice. Uh, he probably won't, but it would be nice. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. <laughs> oh, fuck. That was stupid, wasn't it? I thought I had 100 hit points. I thought I'd be okay to use the Flesh Fiend there. I'm not sure what I took so much damage from at the end. I'll have to go back and look at it. Is there a log or something? I don't know how to check it. Well, that just makes me feel stupid, to be honest. Uh... Man. Man, you click through it, it gives you a little summary of every stage and your first step on it and how it ended. Man, that's disappointing. Well, that is how this game goes. I feel like I gave an accurate representation of the process of playing Rift Wizard. Uh, one or two, really. Which is, it's going fine, and then you, uh, don't pay attention for like one second and then you just die. <laughs> yep. That's cool. Fuck. I didn't think about what I was gonna do if I just died, like, I mean, I knew it was a possibility. Like, it's, it's always around the corner, but... Uh, pfft. shit. Uh. <laughs> uh. I feel like this episode is gonna be super short now because I'm just, I just, I just died. Like, fucking. I guess that's the end of the the series. Uh, this game is pretty fun, and I have, I've definitely enjoyed um doing this like little let's play thing of it, but. I think I said at the start that there was like, oh, maybe I'll, I'll keep running it until I win. And then I was like, it's going to be a really long series if that's the case. And I don't think, I don't think that's going to be the case. I definitely, I'm definitely going to play this game a lot more on my own time. As far as the channel goes, I don't know. I don't know. It's definitely unsatisfying to not get that victory here, but also that's how it goes. I think I'm putting it to bed for now, but... There's there's every possibility that I will return to Rift Wizard 2 uh, as a series. We'll, we'll take another attempt and we'll, we'll come back. But at that point, I may have already beaten it on my own. And if nothing else, I'll at least be a lot more familiar with the game. Uh, so that's a maybe. And maybe once, like in, in two months time, when I'm still playing fucking Persona 3 and I just cannot stand it anymore. I'll throw in another Rift Wizard run to be like, ah oh, yes, I still do like video games. <laughs> oh. uh, anyway, whatever. Uh, that's been Rift Wizard 2. Uh, I'm I'm excited, honestly. Having lost that, like it is disappointing, but now I can just play the game as much as I want. I'm gonna have a fun time with it. So, <laughs> hope it was hope it was interesting. Hope it was enlightening. You know, if if you're not familiar with this game, maybe it it got you onto it and made you feel like giving it a try, which I highly recommend. I think it's really excellent. Uh, and what I've seen of this game so far, I mean, it's obviously building very closely and very heavily off of, of what the first game established, but... Lots of just cool new stuff. Eh, good changes overall. I don't know, like, I... I didn't get to see everything, obviously, but... Impression is good. Thumbs up. Good job, Dylan. I like it audience interaction stuff. Oh, that's like user engagement, right? You're supposed to do stuff like that? Um, if you want me to play Rift Wizard 2 again and put the thing on the internet so that you can see it, let me know. Leave a comment or something. <laughs> Say, I want Rift Wizard 2, you fuck. Nobody cares about Persona, just give me this. And, you know, maybe I'll do it. <laughs> Or maybe I won't, because that's my life. You can't tell me what to do. Alright, um, that's Rift, that was Rift Wizard 2. Thank you for hanging out. And I hope you had a good one. And I'll see you next time, whenever that might be. 
I mean, I'm gonna keep making- there'll be more videos, I mean, it's mostly the Persona stuff, but like... Ugh. I couldn't possibly ask somebody to actually go watch that, because it is insanely long. <laughs> There's a way of obliquely asking people to go watch it. No, 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 that's fine. Anyway, whatever. Uh, I'll catch you later.